I have been killing it. Hi guys, it's Mandy Martinez. Today's July 2nd. This is day one. Let's sit like this. This is day one of my vlog. Instead of a pre-workout photo, um, this is why I don't usually show my whole face. Especially before I work out, because I don't really get done up for that. <laughs> and today I did legs. It was Monday. I've been doing legs twice a week because I am crazy. And I want to have like crazy, fierce legs. Is fear still cool? This is the current. And, but I want to have like these freakish looking legs. So I've been doing legs twice a week. And, um,. Today was my first day, and I like to do legs until I like waddle out of the gym, until I leave and I look gimpy. That's what I like to do. So I think my leg workout, like my warm up for my leg workout, is the equivalent of some people's leg workouts, <laughs> which is fine because I'm psycho. Before, well, actually, kind of during, uh, with my squats, I like to step out, so like shoot up my heel into my hamstring and my glute. I'm sure a lot of fitness fanatics, form squatters, are going to hate on that, and that's fine. One day we're going to go ham to ham, glute to glute, see what players have to say about it then. One of these things is not what the other. And some old man came up to me in the gym and was like, um, that looks like it hurts. And then I was like, sir, it does. Wish I knew how to fuck that real cool. Just think about your goal, keep it moving. It's a tidbit. Stay tuned. Okay. Weird, you can't even help it. It's like uncontrollable with your face. Hi guys, it's Mandy Martinez. Today is July 3rd, 2012. What else? I guess one of the questions a lot of people ask me. Uh, a lot of female, well actually males ask me too, is how long I've been doing this stuff. And then they're like always really surprised when I tell them this is actually going into, this is going to be about a year and a half since I started getting like real hardcore uh, with my fitness stuff. So yeah, about a year and a half, so everybody knows, as of now, July 3rd, 2012, a little over a year and a half now. And and then people will ask me, are you, are you always in shape? Like, no, I wasn't. I was overweight at one point. If you would pay attention to all my YouTube videos, my one of my testimony will tell you that I used to be overweight. I weighed like 164-ish. I don't know, like that. But I have pictures to prove it. So, there is a question. Um, also, even in the off-season, I still eat consistently. I, I'm, I eat pretty clean. I was in Wawa grabbing my banana because right post-workout, after I finish lifting, I eat a banana. That's not how I eat bananas. Because I like to keep a respectable physique year-round. I don't just uh, walk around in shape pre-contest because I just don't think that that's a good look for anybody. <laughs> and I believe in the health and fitness, uh, the health side of health and fitness as well. But I eat banana, I eat a banana, just one banana. I have a coach that keeps me um, sane and <laughs> a lot more who's amazing. That helps me out with a lot of my nutrition questions. <laughs> And she grabs king size Reese's cups. And like anybody that knows me knows that those are my favorite candy like ever. Like I could live probably off of Reese's cups if if there was a protein powder that tasted like Reese's cups. Is there a protein powder that tastes like Reese's cups? I don't know. But if there was, there sh if there's not, there should be. And if there was, I would live off of it. And then I started to think, and I think there's a quote about this about eating for your goal and everything, something like that. And I was just thinking of where my priorities are. I have um, trying to obtain certain goals for my body and, and even with my future that involve my body. So I'm, I'm looking, I'm like, you know what, it's totally not worth it. So I'd rather keep my banana for post-workout than sacrifice and give in to this little craving, this little envious moment of the lady in Wawa. She has no idea that I was so envious of her, and that's fine. I'm not knocking her or anybody else that eats Reese's Cups because I have eaten them before. So, it's just a little, um, a little food for thought. See what I did there? 
So yeah, that happened. Today I did buys, tries, and rear delt. So this is a different um, split for me. But I did it and I actually kind of liked it. Uh, sometimes I try to rush through my rear delts because I love doing laterals and front raises so much on my shoulder days that I think I kind of neglect them a little bit. I don't know. But um, I did that today. I tried a different pre-workout. I'm usually like the queen of um, not the queen, but I'm a huge fan of Gaspari products, so I'm always using like Super Pump or Hey, I tried uh, BSN's and I know Explode Blue Raz. I was not a fan of it, but that's just me. But um, if anybody knows any good pre-workouts, put them in a comment and I'll totally try it out. Tomorrow's the Fourth of July, so. That, I'll be in bikini. I'm not ready for that, but I will be. If you're not following me on Twitter, you should definitely be doing that at Mandy Martinez. Uh, if you're not following me on Instagram, you should definitely be doing that. That's where most of my photos are. Mandy Martinez. It's pretty easy to find me if you know my name. Okay, so get on that. <laughs>